that's the thing. It's cold outside. Where yeah. are you from? Germany. Is Oktoberfest over? Yes, unfortunately. Yeah. Is it only October? Yeah, September and October. Yeah, makes sense. <laughs> so, fantastic movie. Thank you. But why did we have to wait 20 years? The stars weren't lining up. They were yeah. just, every time we wanted to do it, Jim was busy, and then when Jim wasn't busy, we were busy. Uh, we're big teases. <laughs> big teases. Yeah. Lots of foreplay, that's what we oh, like. Lots of foreplay. 20 years of foreplay. <laughs> Imagine the, uh, you know. Yeah, yeah. whoa. Yeah, boom. Yeah, explosive. Like 20 years ago, Jim and Chef just met, right? Now they are yeah. friends, and you know, of course they had the first yeah. one. Was it much different to work like that? It, it, They're both such different people, you know, mm -hmm. uh, that... Uh, uh, it, it, they they just meld together so beautifully that no, it was a, almost exactly like it was 20 years ago. Do you think it's easier for a woman to be dumb because women have the looks men want? I'm not even going to touch that. Are you going to touch that? Do you think it's easier for women to be dumb? Because women um, get away more with dumber things, maybe. No, no, I think ultimately, you know, dumb catches up to you. You know what yeah. I mean? Dumb catches up. You know, it's like you, 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 a dumb girl can get a guy for a little while, and that's you know that's you know she's good looking and whatever and that, and then after a while it's just like ah, there's you got to get out. You have to have somebody to talk to. Yeah, in the end they're all smarter than us anyway. Uh, I don't care how dumb. I think they, you're pandering now. I, I you're pandering. might be a little bit. I might be a little bit. <laughs> wife's right outside. Yeah, wife's right outside. <laughs> You called me what? Nothing. You're 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 brilliant. You're absolutely brilliant. I'm the yeah. How would you describe Jeff and Jim in your own words? If you had a few words to describe him. Well, Jim's a genius, flat out genius. M more so than you know, because what you don't see is what he does before you shoot. He takes the script and we sit with him and he just says, makes it better and better and better and better. And he, then he comes in the editing room and makes it better and better and better and better. He's a he's a creative true genius. genius, no question. Jeff is the most underrated actor I've ever, I, I, I think, in America. He can do anything instantaneously. He's as good as anybody, and he pushes Jim to be better because he, he plays things real. Jeff is real, and uh, he's not, he doesn't do what other comedic actors do. He goes in a real direction, and that pushes Jim uh, to, to be better, too. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> You know, uh, the eclipse. I call him the eclipse. Uh, <clears throat> no, I, uh, you know, I would describe Jeff as uh, uh, a hardy fellow uh, who's uh, very intellectual and, uh, and extremely uh, That's a first. kind. Oh, it's true. And kind and, and, uh, and willing uh, and able to go where n few men are willing to go. Comedic genius, by the way. Oh my God! I will no, but in G G, a small G, if we want to go there, but comedic genius, <laughs> small G, one of a kind, genius with a small G. Only like Jim that. Carrey does what Jim Carrey does, <laughs> and in a world of imitators, that's 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 saying something. So, Jeff, last thing, like when, before I take you slash your brain around, can yeah. you show us that? And what do you do? <laughs> what do I do? And what do you do to one, get in character? Two, three, let's do this. That's where he is.